Hello everyone, I am Pratima. I welcome you all to this video. I will share a worthy visit to Rock Garden Chandigarh which was created by Nek Chand Shaini which is a very important place in our country. Rock Garden of Chandigarh has been alluring its visitors since its inception due to its sheer brilliance and beauty. It is no small wonder and people from far and near visit the place to experience the Bhantashi land up close and personal. The credit for creating this garden goes to Nick Chan who gave life to his imagination and fantasy. In fact, the very story of how this rock garden was formed is more fascinating than the garden itself. This beautiful garden was established in 1957, spread across an area of 40 acres. This garden is also famous for being one of the most eco-friendly gardens in the country, as it is, has been built solely by home waste and other industrial items. Also, the sculptures in the place are being created by using items such as bangles, ceramic pots, tiles, bottles and electrical waste. It won't be exaggeration to state that the brilliantly crafted sculptures in the rock garden of Chandigarh are a delight. Apart from these gorgeous sculptures, the sport also boosts of man-made waterfall and not just these these are other facts about the garden that makes it stand for among other wonders of our country the rock garden of chandigarh was started as a small activity in the 1950s which now has hundreds of sculptures made from waste and discarded materials Millions of tourists from around the world visit the place every year. Nick Chan, the founder of Rock Garden, started creating this garden secretly during his spare time in 1957. He used to work as a road inspector with the public work department and spent almost 20 years to create this beautiful place. He started by collecting stones, discarded junk, stones from nearby villages and gathering them in a small forest patch near Sukana Lake. Nek Chand then used his artistic genius to give wings to his passion. He started making sculptures with those discarded materials and gradually turned the barren patch of land into a fantasy land. You will be surprised to know that people were not aware of this artistic side of Nick Chan as he used to work during the midnight hours without anyone's knowledge and also managed to hide his wonderland and creation from people for more than a decade. Over time, there were more than 2000 sculptures created by him. However, when his secret was discovered, it was not welcomed by open arm by the authorities. They threatened to demolish the place. But when the public got the opportunity to witness this wonderland, they were taken aback and came to support. And the rest is history. All the public stood by him. The government was left with no other choice but to support him and also give him a salary so that he is able to work in this project full time. The government also provided him with extra workforce. The sculptures of Ne Chan have been part of several prestigious exhibitions held around the world. In fact, they have found their way into famous museum across the world. What started as a small activity by a self 
taught artistic genius now holds a prestigious position as being one of the best heritage site of Chandigarh. So it is very worthy to visit beautiful garden in Chandigarh. Nek Chand once said, I have had no formal education or training in art or drawing. I get inspiration from the objects I see and the ideas begin to make shape in my mind. I have a good sense of imagination and capacity to work hard. They help me embody while I visualize. I humbly believe I have the ability to see beauty in what many people consider junk or crap. I reckon it's God's gift to me. Beauty lies in the eyes of the beholder. Really, this is a true fact. Nick Chan Shiny was unique, so he saw beauty in what most or many people cannot see. So he created whole sculpture kingdom from waste materials. This is a tribute to the great person. Thank you for watching.